is Vlogmas Day 7. I can't believe it. It is Tuesday. I almost said Wednesday. And all things are merry and bright. It was a good day. Um, yesterday I was in a little bit of a funk. Um, yeah, I was just in a little bit of a funk. Today felt better. Today, going into the day, I knew I needed to have a very productive day. So I probably kept off like 21 things on my to-do list. I drafted about 18 emails, not only ones for leading up to winter break, but also ones for when we come back from winter break. So I just feel ahead of the game in all of those things. It just feels stinking good. I am getting ready to make Stephen and I dinner about once a week, I do pot stickers for dinner. So that just happens to be tonight. Steven did text and say he was going to get stuff to make tacos, but I figured we can do tacos tomorrow and I will do the pot stickers tonight. What I love about pot sticker night is that it is the easiest dinner night of the week. This is an always pan. Mine doesn't always look like this, but um bum ching. It's in a rough shape, but I do love it. It is great. I don't know if they're worth all the hype, but I really do love the steamer basket. I use it to steam vegetables, and that's really all I've used this pan for. Everyone asks what I use for cookware. I use all clad. They're my favorite pans. They heat so even. So these are my set of all clad. And then for most of my cooking, as you guys see, I have two cabinets of La Creuset. And then all of my bakeware is also La Creuset bakeware. And I keep all of What are you eating off the floor? Nothing. What did you eat? Who ate something off the floor? And then for dinner, it's going to be super simple. I have... And I usually do two packages for dinner because we then use them for lunch. Just the chicken goiza um, pot stickers. I will get the water going. I'll throw this basket on. You steam them for about seven minutes and they're done. Um, they're j it's just such an easy dinner, but I make a really good dipping sauce that I'll share with you right now. Peanut butter. I prefer crunchy for this, but we don't have crunchy. So we're gonna make this work. Soy sauce, crushed red pepper, sesame oil, honey. That's all you need. The reason we need hot water is it is what helps loosen up the peanut butter. So for Steven and I, I always just make extra because we will use this sauce for other things. I'll dip vegetables in it. I'm just gonna grab three spoonfuls of peanut butter and make a mess of it. And then I'm going to add soy sauce. Once again, you guys know me, I do no measurements. The peanut butter is strong, so it typically does take more soy sauce than you would imagine. Just a splash of sesame oil. It's super strong and goes a long way. Honey, and then some crushed red pepper. I actually open it up. I like things spicy. Um, and great, I'm gonna add a splash of hot water just to loosen that peanut butter up and then mix it really well. There, that feels like a good consistency. Steven <laughs> lost Bubba's in the dark. I am catching up on Vlogmases. I've not been watching many, but I love Samantha Joe. I've been watching her. I've been watching Alexandra. I've been watching Christina Brawley, a couple of them. I feel if you're a creator doing Vlogmas, you don't actually watch Vlogmas <laughs> until um, like January because you're so far behind and you're just <laughs> trying to get your own videos edited. I give all the hats off to all of us creators who are doing Vlogmas because it is intense, especially creators who work a job and this is not their job. To work all day and film and edit it, it's like a task. And to do it on the day, every day, is a beast. 
and I'm really proud that I've done it for multiple years, which I don't know. I feel like the only way I missed today is if I traveled for work. So last year was a little bit easier because we were working from home. But I'm gonna get these pot stickers and I lied to you, it's not seven minutes, it's about 10 minutes. Steven's just recounting his adventure last night of falling down or up the stairs. Oh, he fell up the stairs too. And how was he involved in this? Well, he had to go outside, so he was scratching at the bedroom door because he was outside the bedroom. And oh no! I thought he wanted to get into bed, so I tried coaxing him into the bed, and he said no. And he made for the stairs, went down the stairs. And he like, said no. He physically was like, no, thank you. Yes. So he went down the stairs. <laughs> Does he need his advent calendar? Did you give it to him? No. Oh, and then yes. You also need to catch everyone up on David's tea, so let's go uh, ahead and do that. Okay. Are you? Let's do his first. Uh -oh. It's Baba's. I go first. He has to go for a walk. All right. Um, what's today? The seventh. <laughs> I think we're missing some. Calm down. You're gonna break a hip. <laughs> Um, we're missing six and seven. Uh, we'll go back to six, but today is the seventh, so. Well, we'll just do six. Seven seems to be a little bit difficult. You don't have the muscle tone to be jumping on and the he hardwood doesn't. floors. Right. So he's a day behind right now? He is a day behind. We could save his extra for a weekend. Or maybe tomorrow. Or that'll make a good. Oh, yes. Um, I think you're two days off. You have six. No, you have five, six, and seven to open. Uh oh. Uh, five is Blueberry Fields Forever. This smells like Blueberry, blueberry Fields it's, Forever. It's strawberry Fields Forever. I know. Um, Six is a uh, North Star. We'll figure out what that is in a sec. And then seven. Uh, organic Japanese Sencha. Senka? Sencha? So the two. <coughs> North Star. Organic. Organic Jumpity Sunday. Wait, where are your binoculars? So you I, can read it. I think I, I'm, I'm able to do it. Organic steam green tea from Mount Fuji, Japan, kosher. All right, so apparently this comes from Mount Fuji. Here it is. Uh, and then <clears throat> North Star. Sugar orange peel, nana mint, brittle, sugar hazelnut, white star sprinkles, <laughs> natural flavoring, lemongrass, moringa leaf, spinach, spinach, and orange blossom and hazelnuts. Oops, uh oh. Uh oh. You can't say uh oh. Well, I know, just don't repeat it because then it'll Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead over to our spice calendar. It's a spice gals calendar. I was just thinking that. Spice I couldn't gals. remember. I couldn't. I couldn't. I tell you what. I tell you what I want. Whatever I want. So spice gals. All right, that, I'm embarrassed for you right now. All right, day seven is island. Island Pepper Blend. It is a blend of different crushed peppers. Righty, Beekman got a goat milk hand cream. I love that size for traveling. Day seven is an ode and patchouli foaming shower gel. Like I said, I love, love, love the shower gels. 
This is Iris and Amber Bubble Bath. I just love their packaging. It's so pretty. It reminds me of like vintage wallpapers. Uh, day seven, Rolo. Rolo. That's sort of, uh, Bubby, looky, it's Rolo. Hi, it's so good, nice it's to meet him. Dog. So I wonder if uh, they'll have a Labradoodle in there. I don't know, but they're so cute. What's this from? Mary Mary. It's where I always get the figurine one. Oh my goodness, we start the next oh, booklet of them. Yes. So the Fifi must be the poodle. Fifi is the poodle. Let me see if I can remember. Bailey is the lab. Was that Dalmatian? Bruce was this guy. This was... That looks I, like an Aussie. I want to say this was Bella. This is Penny. So that's all of them. Wait. What the French Bulldog. I think that was Tango, maybe? I don't know. I don't remember. You can look back at Vlogmas's day well, one through. Aren't they? Yeah, but I don't remember. Well, they would fit in the... Yeah, but I don't know. You could review all the Vlogmas videos to see which dog is what. Wait, does it say on the back of them? No. That would have been a good idea to write their names. So then you have to watch all the videos. Yeah. Mm. Pour some sugar on me. We got... Strawberry hibiscus bears. Have a holly dolly Christmas. It's the best time of the year. We got like little Christmas gummies. Those are big. So advent calendars are open. Today was to buy coffee for someone, but I didn't go anywhere for coffee. Bubby, did you buy coffee for anyone? No, but uh, we had, I had my morning cup of coffee and he watched me drink it. And you did buy food for people today. Yes, I bought food So we kind of fulfilled the advent calendar. It wasn't coffee though. I'll do, I'll buy someone coffee tomorrow. I buy someone coffee tomorrow. Yes, but, then you're, but then tomorrow you have to write affirmations on post-it and put it in your mirror. I know, that one's easy. I already have my post-its all ready to go. On your own mirror or on somebody else's On mirror? my mirror. So, Maybe I'll write you affirmations. I, I will write old. Er. Er, than you were yesterday. Yeah. I would write supportive, reliable, consistent, smart. I what would you write for me? I sound like uh, compression socks. <laughs> <laughs> because you are as warm and fuzzy as compression socks. What would you write for me? Um, loving, Aww. uh, caring, um, a little bit scatterbrained, <gasps> but that's, that's not a bad thing. thing. Um, and diligent. Aww. And, um, caring. You said caring twice. Did I say caring twice? I think so, but I'll have to look back when we edit. What would we say for him? Um, uh, selfish, demanding, bad attitude, <laughs> uh, cute, uh, geriatric. <laughs> What'd you say? What'd you sink in? It doesn't, can't tell the truth. What'd you sink in? <laughs> A great backup dancer for Lady Gaga? <laughs> yes. Not, not, not right. <laughs> I am going to wrap up day seven. I am excited. Tomorrow is going to be a little tricky with filming just because I have a holiday party for work afterwards. It's a leader dinner, so I'm going to get home late. But we're just going to sit down and chat for day eight, and I'm going to share a bunch of gifts that I am giving this year to people that I work with, friends, etc. My family and I are not exchanging gifts. Steven and I this year have made the decision not to exchange gifts because there's just nothing that we need. So yeah, I don't have shopping except for a handful of people at work, but I wanna share the gifts that I'm giving because I'm giving really unique gifts and I was actually flipping through my gift guide and I don't know if I had even anything over $50 on it. So. I think they're pretty reasonable and I'm excited to share what I'm thinking about giving this year. So with that, I'm gonna wrap up Vlogmas day seven. 
as I always do, take care of yourself, take care of others, be kind, kindness is free, give it to everyone until next time, which will be tomorrow. Bye-bye.